the reason why I like Bijan is because they couldn't run the ball consistently. And again, last year it worked. They were a top five offense. But to assume they're going to make it work this year without having a steady run game, especially if Swift can't stay healthy, to me, Bijan, David Montgomery, DeAndre Swift, you could tell Swift, listen, you can either A, play, and if you get injured, get lost, or you could just sit behind Bijan Robinson because let's be real here. As much as I like DeAndre Swift, Bijan Robinson day one is already better than DeAndre, DeAndre Swift. I'm sorry. It's the truth. So for Bijan to me, it's more of a BPA pick. Uh, as much as you don't like running backs in the first round, you can argue Bijan's worth a first round pick. He's that dynamic. And for him, with David, with this offensive line, you got him for five years at least. To me, it's worth it because there's no other running back worth it besides, you know, Jameer in the second. But Bijan's by far the best running back. You could have sold me on Bijan at I don't six hate it. if Brad Holmes wouldn't have signed David Montgomery. Are you serious? Bijan at six, you'd be okay no, with No, no, not that I'm okay with it, but you could have sold me the narrative that, hey, the Lions are locking in on potentially taking Bijan because they didn't sign a running back, but they did. But they did. But what if you can get him at 18 for cheaper money? For what, though? It's never bad to add to— You're paying to him $15 million to be a running back for the next four years on top of paying— five. Well, it is four, and then the fifth-year option yeah. would be top-tier running back money, whatever right. it is. You're paying fifteen million over four years, which is almost what you're giving David Montgomery. I, I, it doesn't make sense to me. To it's me. Great. I, I don't see Brad personally. Doing that. I, I don't. see a top ten player, maybe top three, top five talent. If he's there at eighteen, to me, that's that's value, and it's worth it for a guy like Bijan with this offensive line. To, to the argument to me, and as much as I don't like the wide receiver conversation, I understand it because you can tell me, Jeff, even though offense was their strength, why not add to a strength already? The defense, you can they've built through free agency. They're going to continue to build through the draft. If you take Bijan, it doesn't mean your defense can't get better. You can still address it later in the draft, but Bijan, to me, it's worth it for his talent and what he could do behind this offensive line what? for Jared Goff. Jared made the Super Bowl, not saying he's Todd Gurley, Hear me but out. with an excellent run game, we know what Jared Goff can do. 